so Facebook and Instagram are improve. They're both improving their AI for captions, image captions. Uh, when you know when you when you're posting photos, you should be going in and um, essentially like adding a description to your photo. So if someone was uh, blind or having a, a visually or visually impaired, they'll be able to tell what's in your photo because it reads um, it'll read the caption out loud. And uh, essentially the alt, it's called the alt text. I couldn't think of the word. The alt text is the phrase, but essentially it's like the metadata within your photo. So it tells if you've ever taken a photo and you've adjusted that, um, but um, it's the AI. So in case you're not putting those descriptions on your photos, it is able to dig a little deeper instead of just being uh, the example I give is like, this is an image, maybe a person of one, maybe an image of a person standing at Machu Picchu. And now they're like, maybe an image of five people, including this person playing musical instruments, two people are standing, two hats, five drums. So it's a much broader description, which is really, really cool. And it's, it's amazing how, well, it's, we, we should be further along with the AI, I think, as far as this kind of stuff goes. But it's, um, they kind of, it's a huge jump from where they've been to where they are now, which is exciting. And um, giving the position of the different photo people in the photo, it's, it's really neat. So in case you, you're not adding image descriptions for your alt text on your uh, photos, uh, people who are blind or visually impaired will still be able to enjoy them. So is this is this happening across the board, regard, regardless of opt-in at this point? Yeah, it sounds like it's just a thing that is just happening. Because, yeah. I mean, um, and, you know, the, the general poster, you know, is not doing this. Like, mm-hmm. isn't even thinking about, like, the only reason we do, because we work in the space, right? Mm-hmm. Um, so, so that's good. Cause you're not going to get, you're not going to get a mass amount of people to do this. And then you basically have just like have a white slate on half of it for, for the, for the impaired, um, when you're doing yeah. visuals. And I've never, and I, I need to dive a little deeper into this, but I've never, um, I don't know how much it impacts the searchability of your photos mm-hmm. on Facebook and Instagram, because essentially, cause it is metadata that if you were searching, we were Googling an image of something and you have in your alt text, uh, I'm looking for a white horse in a field or whatever Mm -hmm. um, was an example. Uh, If that would pop up because the, the alt text being on there and if the AI was able to assist with that, but I haven't, yeah, I haven't really seen a lot of information in regards to that. If it um, helps with the searchability. So it looks like um, as it's saying here in the, in the tech crunch article, uh, the new detailed description will uh, come to Facebook first for testing, though the improved vocabulary will appear on Instagram soon. So, you know, kind of behind the scenes, but it helps out um, um, other people. So 